we all encounter some of the most serious challenges in our personal and professional life. Sometimes we can solve it and many times we end up making things even more complicated while trying to solve them. We might have challenges with our boss or with our life partners or maybe we are struggling with our own habits that we want to improve upon. Let us understand what Buddha advises to solve these complicated problems in our lives. This powerful story will give you a practical strategy to solve your most pressing challenges. One morning, Buddha came to address the assembly of the monks. The monks were waiting to listen to Buddha. They got puzzled when they saw that Buddha had come with a rope in his hand. This was the first time when he has brought something to the assembly and they eagerly wanted to know why Buddha was holding a rope in his hand. Buddha sat on a raised platform. He remained silent. Instead of talking to the monks, he looked at the rope and started tying knots on the rope. He tied three knots on the rope. Everyone was watching silently and observing what the great teacher was doing. Suddenly he asked the assembly, Can anyone tell me if the rope in my hand is the same as it was before I tied the knots? One of the monks said, It depends on how we see the rope. In a way, the rope is still the same because the substance of the rope has remained unchanged. And as far as the inner nature of the rope is concerned, the rope is still the same. But if we see its external form, the rope has now got changed because of the knots that you have tied. From this perspective, it is not the same rope. Now, its form has changed while its inner substance is still the same. Buddha said, Yes, this is true. He got up and said, Now, I need to open these knots. And he started pulling the rope from both of its ends. He asked the monks again, Can I open the knots by pulling the rope and stretching it from both ends? One of the disciples said, Tathagat, the knots will become tighter and it will get even more difficult to open if we keep on pulling the rope from the ends. Buddha said, That's true. Can someone suggest what should I do if I need to open the knots? The disciple replied again, Tathagat, first we need to come closer to the rope and observe the knot closely to figure out how the knot was tied in the first place. Once we understand and realize how the knot was formed, we can figure out how to open it. Unless we know how the knot was tied, it is very difficult to open it. Buddha said, That's right. This is the most important question to be asked before we solve our challenges. First, we need to observe and understand our knots before we even try to free ourselves from the knots of attachment, anger and suffering. If we don't understand the nature of our problem, and start trying to solve it, we might end up making the problem even more severe. This is all I needed to teach you today. We immediately start trying to solve our problems by stretching ourselves from both ends. This is exactly what we keep on doing all the time when we encounter any challenge. Generally, we start to solve it even before trying to understand how we got into it in the first place. We are always on the lookout for some ready-made solutions and some shortcuts to our challenges. When we are trying too hard without understanding the nature of the problem, we might end up making our challenges even more complicated and worse. We need to be mindful of our challenges. The practice of mindfulness can help us solve many of our challenges. If you found value in this video, please give it a thumbs up. We are constantly coming out with new videos on the life of Buddha and the Buddhist heritage. If the information provided by the video was useful, please subscribe to the channel for similar videos on Buddhism. Please share your thoughts in the comment section below regarding what are the knots in your life and how mindfulness can help open those knots.